Hello everyone, I'm back. It's been a long time I posted videos because we had uh, another house that we, uh, we were renovating in Ontario. So I set up the kitchen outside, everything is done. Finally, life is back to normal. So I'll be posting more videos from now on. And uh, this is like a pretty much like a tiny home, like a single bedroom, like an apartment. We divided the house into half. So it's very beautiful, cute, very tiny, but very efficient. Kitchen, everything is done. I am very crazy about having herb tea, fresh herb tea. I usually plant herbs in the house. In the kitchen, I usually have, use like fresh herbs. I bought like basil, rosemary, thyme, oregano. I'll be buying more. This video is basically like a dollar store haul and herb planting. So I got this terracotta planter, it's four dollars. This is the plate that goes under for the water to drain. So this plate, this one is three dollars. Plant almost five herbs, one, two, three, four, five. I have five plates and five pots. I have like mint too that I already planted. So I'm going to replant it in this. So that way for the winter I'll have fresh herbs. Okay, I'm going to show you another thing. This is the potting mix they had in the dollar store. This potting mix is like three, three dollars or something. So which is like very inexpensive. And potting mix a potting mix. The more they stayed in the store, the older they are, the better it is. I went outside and I need to stain the soil because that was not a very good soil started getting fungus so I actually brought it from my daughter's house this mint smells really good this uh, spreads Mint is easy to plant, but when you plant it, plant it in ground, it'll take over everything. So. Replanted mint, and uh, I'm going to be replanting the basil. Water is very hard here, so most of the houses we have water softener. That water has a lot of salt. The softener uses salt to soften the water. So basically, that water you cannot cook and eat, or that water you cannot uh, drink. That water you cannot put for plants. So. You have to be very careful. People don't realize that they are like watering like salt water, which is not good for the plant. So I use the water filter water that we are drinking. Usually that's what I pour for my plants. This is the filter water I'm using. Outside in the garden, that water is not connected to the softener. So those, that is okay to plant, like use, but when you do indoor and if you're going to do like pots like this, then you have to use filter water or like water that you're drinking 
some of them don't have water softness, then they can use that water. Okay. My mint is ready. I'm going to again repot this one here because the potting soil was not good. I just pulled it from the ground. So I'm going to uh, go outside, remove the soil and put the new soil in. share, subscribe and comment. I'll be coming up with more videos. I just thought I'd start with my herbs like it's a, on a positive note. Okay, so I'll see you guys soon in more videos. Bye bye.